YouTube pipe smoking community, Sage of Two Dogs. Ten days away from St. Nicholas showing up. Merry Christmas to everybody. And we're going to do a tobacco review of Figgy Pudding. The Country Squire in uh, Jackson, Mississippi. World famous, one-off holiday blend tobacco. So, um, just a little review of the Country Squire, if you've not heard of them before. Wonderful little tobacco shop, gone through multiple owners over the years. They make custom blend aromatics, custom blend Balkans and English Middle Earth tobaccos. You can find them by... Um, Procuring www.thecountrysquireonline.com and just travel through their website, look at the different tobaccos, get the different blends, um, and order a couple of ounces and have them sent to you. The Country Squire, like several other a uh, wonderful independent tobacconist out there are one of, of just a few that have world famous holiday blend tobaccos. And so let's go ahead and enjoy some of this one right now. This is a uh, Harvey, my pipe holder, Harvey the pig. And then uh, of course, I have a uh, pipe roll here that has this pipe holder over here. Got to give a shout out to H. Clay uh, Tobacco Mints. Um, they are an incredibly strong mint. And for those that have been... Uh, smoking a cigar or a pipe, you will find a, uh, a heavy mint to get rid of that tobacco wash. So, got my little cheat sheet paper here. Um, the uh, Country Squire in Jackson, Mississippi was established in 1970. John David Cole is the current proprietor and blender. Uh, this is their Christmas seasonal blend called Figgy Pudding. Um, they sell it in two ounce servings, and you do not get a price discount for buying a pound or, or two pounds, etc. You're going to pay, I think right now it's $9.10 for every two ounces, which is going to be upwards of, you know, uh, 70 bucks a pound. Um, the tobacco is a deep burly ribbon with some Virginias and some really dark chips of uh, black Cavendish. It's a little damp um, when you get it. Uh, but it's a it's an awesome, awesome uh, smell and flavor. Um, the first hint you get is uh, is there's a little bit of uh, vanilla and, uh, and, and, and cocoa uh, in there. Maybe a little bit of cherry, um, maybe some clove. Uh, and, and some people say they can almost uh, get a port wine uh, smell. I definitely get a, um, and I'll, I'll show you the, the tobacco. You can see the, the burly, the Cavendish. It has one of the most unique smells of a pipe tobacco 
that I have ever smelled. And what you notice for sure is there are certain tobaccos that you remember. And you could be somewhere across the continent and, and pass a, a bag and that smell would reach out to you. Um, this is one of those tobaccos. And um, the first time I ever lit it, you know, I, I try all kinds of different tobaccos. The first time I ever lit it, it was a, a wow moment for me. Um, just the, the mouth flavors were incredibly sweet. Um, there's a little peppery tanginess to it, the sours. Uh, it's just absolutely uh, you know, wonderful. I find the, the way I enjoy this tobacco the most is with uh, hot coffee or maybe a, uh, uh, an apple spiced rum. It is just absolutely wonderful. Um, we were at the Biltmore two weeks ago having dinner and I was told that this tobacco smelled like Tierra Masu wafting across the air. on the initial light, you really get that sour chocolate coming across your palate. So the figgy pudding that's been in this little um, charter bag, I took out of this one pound bag two days ago. It hasn't been dried, it's just been in there. I'll go, I put an ounce in there and I'll go through that ounce in about a week. Your friends and colleagues that are over at your house for, for the holiday season will enjoy this almost as much as you will for the simple fact that the aromatics wafting through your home smells like holiday cookies. I wouldn't say it smells like Christmas cookies, but I will tell you it just has a warm holiday smell. Is there anything that I am not touching on? Well, I can't think of anything other than I'll tell you that figgy pudding hits on all of the things that one would want from a holiday seasonal blend tobacco from a caring conscientious tobacconist it's it's fun it smells good it tastes wonderful it's a dessert tobacco like a dessert wine it's not a daily port although i bought enough of this figgy pudding this year that I could smoke it all year long if I wanted. Um, I wouldn't say this is a tobacco that you can sell her and, and, and it'd be any better five years from now. 
Um, it's not a Balkan or an English blend, it's an aromatic. But I will tell you that of all of the Hollandaise blends that I have tried from the Gatlin Burlier and, and uh, Boswell and, and, uh, and a few others, this for me is the best blend uh, of a holiday um, um, seasonal tobacco. Just absolutely love it. If I wouldn't talk so much, I'd keep it lit. It's not the tobacco's fault, it's mine. The tobacco does require some manipulation. You gotta put some oxygen to the fire to keep it burning. My little falcon. Some holiday music in the background. Stayed home today because got up this morning and there was a little bit of ice on the back deck and some on my driveway. And they were calling for a tenth or two tenths of ice and then it was going to get warmer this afternoon. It has. Um, was busy today even though I, you know, didn't go into the office today to do any uh, project management work. Uh, anytime you're home in the middle of the week, there are plenty of things to do at home. So I pray that you have a great holiday season. Don't forget the reason for the season. Enjoy your pipe. Enjoy your trinkets. And uh, be respectful of those around you. A word of wisdom. Hmm. The only word of wisdom I can give you right now is just be thankful for what you have. It's not the money in your bank account. It's not the car you drive. It's the people that love you, that want you around them, and that you want to be around. Um, don't be impatient with, uh, with others and give consideration. Uh, and give forgiveness. It's what this holiday is all about. For the Sage of Two Dogs, peace out. God bless. Hope you have enjoyed this tobacco review of Figgy Pudding. Go out there and get you some, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.